The organization that we're representing today is the American Medical Women's Association at UIC. The mission of our chapter is to empower aspiring healthcare pro providers to work alongside other students and leaders in medicine to collectively uplift women in the medical profession and improve the quality of care delivered to women and children. Our goals are to spread awareness and education for various public health initiatives, like disability inclusion, as well as to create a network for undergraduate pre-health students. We propose to have a speaker series focused on inclusivity. We would like to make it a point to invite guest speakers with various backgrounds that may have been challenged by the institution of medicine, whether as a patient or as a provider. This would include a speaker that identifies with having a disability. Thus, we can encourage open conversation with our members to remind them to be cognizant of disability, both visible and invisible, as they continue on into their career. This would also provide guidance and offer an important connection in our network for any students that also identify as having a disability. We have already established an annual AMLA conference with activities like bias training to ensure that students in our organization remain aware and conscientious as they begin to practice, but would like to extend this to have another workshop regarding communication strategies for those with disabilities. For example, encouraging our group to understand the importance of maintaining eye contact or speaking directly to a person rather than their assistant. In terms of our policies, we want to make sure that we prioritize accommodations. We want to implement and broadcast a clear accommodation policy to ensure that we are encouraging inclusivity by adding this to our constitution as well. Some examples for our virtual events we would do is record events and post them on YouTube with closed captioning for those who have difficulty hearing. We would also describe images posted on Instagram or elsewhere for those who have visual impairments. We want to keep a quiet space or virtual breakout room for those who would like a break. Now, in terms of our in-person events, we would want to make sure to host events in wide places with ramps that accommodate wheelchairs. And we want to be mindful of the space by not using lighting that could be triggering and developing a routine to allow for predictability and ease for our events. With the prize money, some ways you would utilize it would be to pay for an ASL interpreter for in-person events or real-time closed captioning for virtual events through our Disability Resource Center. We want to invest in a box of anxiety and stress relieving toys to keep at every in-person event to help with mindfulness and induce mental focus for our members. And finally, you want to organize the inclusivity speaker series and communication workshops with the prize money. Essentially, in the subsequent semesters, we hope to brand AMWA as a space for inclusivity and diversity by implementing the strategies mentioned earlier. Thank you for listening.